Hello everyone, welcome to Study IQ. This video will be in English language for all my English language viewers from North, South or East or West, wherever you are in India. If you prefer to watch the video in English, then this is the video for you. In this video, I will cover 183 questions from just 5 days. Now, we are covering a lot of questions. We are making sure that each and every corner of every newspaper is accounted for and uh, these questions are made from almost 15 to 16 newspapers and therefore uh, you can trust uh, our current affairs. If you do our current affairs uh, with sincerity, you need not follow any other resource, be it any magazine, newspaper or anything. These are sufficient. Almost 95 to 99% of the questions in the past one year in almost every exam have, if, have been from our current affairs. So 27 Jan to 31st Jan, last five days of Jan, I will cover in this video. If you want to uh, follow me on Facebook, the link is given below. Uh, I share a lot of interesting things on my profile. And our pen drives uh, are updated. You will get two videos every week besides 200 odd videos that are a part of our pen drive course. If you wish to prepare, uh, then uh, this is one of the best ways to prepare. Very conceptual videos. So if you want to buy, you need to dial this number 9580048004. So without further delay, let me begin. How much amount has the Aditya Birla group decided to invest in the next two years in the state of Andhra Pradesh? Andhra Pradesh, Aditya Birla group uh, has decided to invest 7000 crore to expand their business and Andhra Pradesh has a, a Telugu Desam party. The chief minister is Chandra Babu Naidu and the capital is Amravati. When is the International Holocaust Remembrance Day observed? So you know that Hitler killed almost uh, 20 lakh, 2 million Jews uh, as is suggested by some. Some say that uh, 6 million Jews were killed. Anyways, in Germany, there were concentration camps where Jews were systematically uh, killed and uh, those camps were located in Auschwitz. Auschwitz concentration camps. So, a uh, lot of people were killed and uh, United Nations uh, recognized that event and uh, to remember those who died every year on 27 Jan, we celebrate the International Holocaust Remembrance Day. Please note that this is a very important question. Name the cryogenic engine which was successfully tested by the Indian Space Research Organization recently in Tamil Nadu. Cryogenic means any engine that can work at low temperature that is a cryogenic engine. The word cryo means excessive cold or very low temperature. So cryogenic engine uh, was tested by ISRO recently in Tamil Nadu and ISRO's headquarter is in Bengaluru. And chairman of ISRO is A.S. Kiran Kumar. It has been asked lot of times. The engine name is C25. Which company has recently announced its intention to acquire US money transfer company MoneyGram for $880 million? $880 million is just under $1 billion. So it is somewhere around 6,000 crore rupees. And it is a company from China, not India. The company name is Ant Financial. As you can see here, this is an Ant. And by the way, this Ant Financial company is a subsidiary of a, another bigger company from China, the biggest e-commerce company of China called Alibaba. And the founder of Alibaba is Mr. Jack Ma, another favorite question. And uh, Alibaba's company is Ant Financial and Ant Financial company has acquired American company MoneyGram. This is a question from merger and acquisition from business GK, which most of the students don't prepare. Which state governor, he had to resign because he faced charges of sexual harassment and therefore uh, he had to resign. So it was the governor of Meghalaya. His name is V. Shanmugunathan. V. Shanmugunathan, he resigned from Raj Bhavan. The, uh, the you know, house of a governor is called Raj Bhavan in every state. As per the recent report, which is released by Walnut app, which state has been ranked in India first in the cashless India scorecard? So basically this state has been doing a lot of uh, these transactions cashless and uh, for the seminal work done to promote digital it has been ranked number one it is Gujarat please note that the capital of Gujarat is Gandhinagar and chief minister of Gujarat not many people know because he is not very popular Vijay Rupani he is from Bharti Janta party he took over when Anandi Ben Patel resigned because of corruption charges how many memorandum of understanding MOU have been signed between India and United Arab Emirates on January 25, 2017 to boost bilateral ties. So the Crown Prince of Abu Dhabi from UAE, Mr. Uh, Sheikh uh, Nayan was here and uh, he signed 
विद प्रधानमंत्री नरेंद्र मोदी फोर्टीन मेमोरेंडम ऑफ अंडरस्टैंडिंग प्लीज नॉट दैट इंडिया यू ए रिलेशन इज वन ऑफ द मोस्ट आस क्वेश्चन इन एग्जाम इफ यू आर प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर यू पी एस सी मेन्स नेम द इंडियन इलेक्ट्रिक यूटिलिटीज कंपनी दैट साइंड अ मेमोरेंडम ऑफ अंडरस्टैंडिंग विद द कंपनी ऑफ यूनाइटेड अरब एमिरेट्स कॉल्ड आबू धाबी वाटर एंड इलेक्ट्रिसिटी अथॉरिटी ए डी डब्ल्यू ई ए फॉर म्यूचुअल कॉपरेशन इन द पावर सेक्टर फॉर दैट देर वर एम ओ यू साइंड एंड दिस इंडियन कंपनी इज ऑफ कोर्स द पावर ग्रिड कॉरपोरेशन ऑफ इंडिया लिमिटेड दैट इज पावर ग्रिड कॉरपोरेशन ऑफ इंडिया लिमिटेड पी जी सी आई एल एंड एम ओ यूज वर साइन इन द फील्ड ऑफ मेंटेनेंस एसेट मैनेजमेंट एंड मैनी अदर थिंग्स नेम द वन मंथ लॉन्ग इंडियन नेवल एक्सरसाइज विच बिगैन ऑन जनवरी द ट्वेंटी फोर टू एनेबल द नेवी स्ट्रेंथ इट्स इंटर ऑपरेटेबिलिटी ऑपरेबिलिटी इन द कॉम्प्लेक्स एनवायरमेंट सो दीज नेवल एक्सरसाइजेज आर कंडक्टेड बिटवीन टू फ्रैक्शन ऑफ द इंडियन नेवी और बिटवीन वेरियस कंट्रीज ऑल्सो समटाइम्स लाइक फॉर एग्जाम्पल लुक एट ऑप्शन वन मालाबार इट इज अ वेरी पॉपुलर एक्सरसाइज बिटवीन इंडिया जपैन एंड यू एस इट इज कंडक्टेड इन द इंडियन ओशियन वेरी नियर टू साउथ चाइना सी एंड जस्ट द पार्ट वेर इंडियन ओशियन मीट्स साउथ चाइना सी दैट पार्ट टू स्केयर चाइना एंड दिस नेवल एक्सरसाइज हाउ एवर वॉज इन विद इन द फ्रैक्शन ऑफ द इंडियन नेवी इट इज कॉल्ड ट्रोपैक्स ट्रोपैक्स और द थिएटर रेडीनेस थिएटर रेडीनेस ऑपरेशनल एक्सरसाइज इन शॉर्ट ट्रोपैक्स नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज वट अमाउंट ऑफ फंड हैव बीन एलोकेटेड बाय द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ आंध्र प्रदेश टू इन्वेस्ट इन फिनटेक स्टार्टअप सो वट एग्जैक्टली इज अ फिनटेक स्टार्टअप फिनटेक बेसिकली मीन्स दैट द स्टार्टअप इज रिलेटेड टू द टेक्नोलॉजी स्पेस एंड फॉर दैट द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ आंध्र प्रदेश विल इन्वेस्ट रुपीज वन हंड्रेड करोड हंड्रेड करोड रुपीज विल बी इन्वेस्टेड अकॉर्डिंग टू द करप्शन परसेप्शन इंडेक्स बाय ट्रांसपेरेंसी इंटरनेशनल वट इज इंडिया इज रैंक अमंग वन हंड्रेड सेवेंटी सिक्स कंट्रीज so we all know that india is a very corrupt country there are no two ways about it and transparency international is a very uh, i mean it's a very respected and recognized uh, organization international organization the headquarter of transparency international is in the capital of germany that is berlin and india's rank is a very very poor 79 as expected now the least corrupt country of the world that means the country that performed best on this index the first place is shared by denmark and new zealand denmark it is a scandinavian country with its capital as Cop at copenhagen and new zealand's capital is wellington and as we know it's an oceanic country it lies in the uh, in the rim of the pacific ocean the so called the uh, the the dark rim or the ring of fire so new zealand lies just at the corner of the rim of fire in the pacific ocean so the answer is 79 name the telecom company which has bagged a 500 million that is half a billion contract by vodafone so this is uh, you can say 3300 crore rupees which telecom company has got a contract by vodafone to deploy and expand the fourth generation network in the country or the 4g network it is the nokia nokia company right now it is uh, acquired by microsoft and therefore all the future mobile phones of nokia will be uh, by microsoft and nokia is a company from Finland name the payment gateway which will be launched by the government for its bheem app bheem is a, a mobile app it is like a digital wallet from the government side and it is called bharat interface for money it is named bheem after bheem rao ambedkar ji whose birthday falls on 14th of april that is when we will celebrate the anniversary of dr bheem rao ambedkar and they, using this uh, it is like a mobile wallet from government and they have prepared a pathway for it that is the aadhar pay pathway aadhar pay and bheem was the app that had created uh, the most downloads record also recently in which city did state bank of india launch their wealth management product called sbi exclusive sbi exclusive is the name of the uh, wealth management product by state bank of india and it was launched in kochi in kerala another thing state bank of india chairman is arundhati bhattacharya which bank has signed an mou with tirath agro technology private limited to boost the agricultural financing for farmers for distressed farmers it's a like a loan facility finance facility and the bank that has launched it is the karnataka bank karnataka bank limited from which country did the health for humanity yogathan it was organized by hindu swamsevak sangh it uh, 
uh, it got recognition on its 10th anniversary and this ceremony was also called Surya Namaskar Yajna or the Surya Namaskar uh, Yag. It's like a process Surya Namaskar, ex an exercise that is said to reform the entire body. And uh, this particular Yajna by Hindu Swam Sevak Sangh that is Health for Humanity Yogathan was organized in the United States of America. And it will be from January, it was from January 14 to January 29 to mark Makar Sakranti. Name the scientist who has been selected for the 2016 National Geoscience Award for his tremendous work in the field of geo-environmental studies in applied geosciences. So his name is Dr. A. Keshav Krishna uh, and uh, he is a scientist at the National Geophysical Research Institute which is in Hyderabad. National Geophysical Research Institute is in Hyderabad capital of Telangana. How many Indian origin person persons received the highest civilian honor of Australia for the year 2017? So these are basically doctors. There are three doctors. Uh, one is Dr. Makhan Singh Khangure from Perth. Then there is Dr. Purushottam Savarikar from Sydney and Dr. Vijay Kumar. They have made immense contribution in the Australian medical research. For that, they got the highest civilian honor of Australia. Capital of Australia is Canberra and the head of state of Australia is Malcolm Turnbull. Very, very important person. Malcolm Turnbull. With which state have HPCL and Gale signed a pact to set up 40,000 crore rupees petrochemical plant in this state? HPCL and Gale, you know that they are very, very important public sector undertakings. HPCL is Hindustan Petroleum Corporation Limited and Gale is Gas Authority of India Limited. And together they will set up a project. 50-50 is the investment, 20,000 crore by HPCL and 20,000 crore by Gale. They will set it up in Andhra Pradesh. And if they ask that uh, in which place in Andhra Pradesh, it will be set up at Kaki Nada. Which state government launched the Dulari Kanya scheme? to check infant mortality. Infant mortality means that when as soon as a new baby is born, the baby dies due to unhygienic conditions or medical issues. So to check or to prevent infant mortality, to bring down the values of infant mortality, which state government has launched Dulari Kanya. Dulari Kanya means loved daughter scheme, pampered daughter. Uh, so it was started by Arunachal Pradesh. Arunachal Pradesh, the capital is Itanagar. In which of the following states did the 2017 Confederation of Indian Industry Partnership Summit recently start? Confederation of Indian Industry uh, Summit, it was recently held again in Andhra Pradesh. Where in Andhra Pradesh? Vishakapatnam, which is a coastal town. Vishakapatnam, near the sea. Which state government recently organized Farmers Martyrs Day to pay homage to the martyrs of 1894 farmers rising in the state so basically there is a uh, there is a story behind it there is a anecdotal there is an anecdotal uh, story so 1894 farmers rising was uh, 140 innocent farmers were killed by the british and uh, therefore there was an uprising so uh, 140 farmers who died and over 150 had been injured uh, and to commemorate we celebrate farmers martyr day it is celebrated in assam Assam, the capital is Dispur and Chief Minister is Bharat from Bharti Janta Party, Sarbanand Sonowal. According to the magazine, the American interest, this is a foreign policy magazine in America, very, very popular. What is the rank of India in the list of eight great powers of 2017? So in 2000, for 2017, we are ranked now number sixth. And uh, first position is, of course, America in this particular list. And at second position, we have two countries, China and Japan. And therefore, there is no country at third because at second, we have two countries. So at fourth, we have Russia. Fifth, we have Germany. India is sixth and Iran is seventh. Shekhar Nayak, uh, he has been selected for the Padma Shri Award. Now, Prashant Dhawan has made a separate video on the Padma Awards. That is Padma Shri, Padma Bhushan and Padma Vibhushan. Do check that video out. It has the complete coverage of all the associated fields and uh, the gentleman. So Shekhar Nayak is associated with which sport? He is associated with cricket and he is associated with blind cricket that is cricket for the visually impaired. Please note that India is organizing blind cricket world cup. It started on 29th of Jan. It is still going on and the brand ambassador for that is Rahul Dravid. Name the union ministry which has instituted or started the national entrepreneurship awards. 
This is basically to give encouragement to the entrepreneurs and uh, these awards were launched by the Ministry of Skill Development and Entrepreneurship. So the answer is A, Ministry of Skill Development and Entrepreneurship and the first award ceremony took place on 30th of Jan 2017 and the awards were handed over by a person no less than the Home Minister of India, Rajnath Singh Ji. Which state government has organized the 2017 Brahmaputra Literary Festival? So there is a Jaipur Literary Festival that started in Rajasthan on uh, 19th of Jan and there is Brahmaputra Literary Festival. Now you know that Brahmaputra River, it is in Assam and Arunachal. So the first two options you can negate just like that. So you can use your common sense and the answer for this particular question is Assam. So it's a three day uh, long festival which started on January the 28th. What is the theme of the 29th Kerala Science Congress uh, organized in Kerala from January 28th onwards? It is 29th Kerala Science Congress and its theme was genomics in health and science. So this topic was related to environment and ecology. Which state government has approved or ratified the proposal of Bhutan to set up a consulate general office of the royal government of Bhutan in Guwahati? So you know that Guwahati is in Assam. So Assam government uh, got a request from Bhutan. Bhutan capital is Thimpu and the request from the Bhutanese side was that they want to make a consulate or office for the ambassador in the in the town of Guwahati in Assam and it was approved by the government of Assam. What is the rank of Indian Think Tank Observer Research Foundation, ORF, Observer Research Foundation, what is its rank in, uh, you know, among all the uh, think tanks of, uh, uh, of Asia? So, you know, uh, if you uh, followed Raisina Hill Dialogue, Raisina Dialogue, uh, it was conducted recently and uh, Raisina Dialogue is conducted in collaboration with ORF Observer Research Foundation and it is ranked number one in Asia by United States Lauder Institute. Think tank it is basically uh, think tank it is basically a, an institute or an organization that uh, helps the government or it can be independent also which performs some certain specific function in a particular field that is called a think tank. It helps in the policy decisions also. With which country's prime minister did the US President Donald Trump hold his first summit after being sworn in as the president? This is a super important question. I'll tell you why. So Donald Trump, he, after becoming the president, he became the 45th president of the United States of America. He took his oath and uh, his first major meeting is with Theresa May. Theresa May. And there were a lot of protests in uh, UK that uh, Theresa May should not meet Donald Trump. But then for, uh, you know, after Brexit, uh, UK will be alone and UK cannot afford to let go of the support of the United States of America. So therefore Theresa May did meet Donald Trump. The answer is UK. And what is UK? UK is Britain plus Northern Ireland and Britain is Scotland plus Wales plus England. These three countries are called Britain and if you add North Ireland it becomes UK. Scotland capital is Edinburgh, Wales capital is Cardiff and England capital is London. With which digital payment company has the loan uh, giving app Cash, it is called C-A-S-H-E, signed an agreement on January 27 to enable its users deposit the loan amount in the digital wallet. So this mobile app Cash E, it, uh, you know, it wants its users to deposit the loan amounts in the digital wallet of Paytm. And please note Paytm founder is Vijay Shekhar Sharma. This question has been asked over and over in exams. And Vijay Shekhar Sharma has another company which is called 197 Communications and in this company Vijay Shekhar Sharma recently sold 1% stake. Worth how much amount ha have the oil PSUs, the oil government companies of India signed an MOU with the Andhra Pradesh government to set up projects in the state. So basically all the oil PSUs of India and you know which are the oil PSUs of India. It is HPCL, Hindustan Petroleum, ONGC, Oil and Natural Gas Corporation and Gale, Gas Authority of India Limited. Together they have signed uh, MOUs worth 1.65 crore rupees with the government of Andhra Pradesh. Who has been appointed as the new governor of Meghalaya? See, Meghalaya's governor, uh, Mr. V. Shanmugunathan, he was caught in sexual harassment cases and he was removed. And therefore, new government of Meghalaya is Mr. Banwari Lal Purohit. He is already a uh, governor of Assam, but he is given additional charge as the governor of Meghalaya also for the time being. Name the chief of army staff, Indian chief of army staff, who launched a WhatsApp helpline number to address the grievances of army personnel. 
So basically, we saw that what happened in BSF. One Jawan of BSF was not happy with the food and he put up a video on Facebook uh, denouncing the food, uh, completely rejecting the food and criticizing the food. So basically, that video went viral and it brought a bad name to BSF. Such cases should not be there in Indian Army and therefore there is a grievances helpline number, WhatsApp helpline number launched by our Chief of Army Staff Bipin Rawat. Scientists from which country have discovered an ancient insect preserved in amber having its own specific order of existence. So we do know that there have been a lot of uh, biological specimens which we got intact. For example, mummies in Egypt. Similarly, there is an insect which was preserved in amber and uh, scientists from which country they unearthed it? It is the United States scientist from the Oregon State University, OSU. Which animated character has been selected as the brand ambassador of the 2020 Tokyo Olympics? So in 2016, we had Olympic Games at Rio de Janeiro in Brazil. In 2020, they will be at Tokyo, capital of Japan. And Japan's head of state is Shinjo Abe and the currency of Japan is Yen. Don't confuse it with Yuan. Yuan or Renminbi is the currency of China. And then this animated character is Son Goku. Son Goku and Son Goku is a character from the from the famous series Dragon Ball Z. Dragon Ball Z is the series and Son Goku is the name of the character. Who is the head of the reconstituted TOP committee to identify the identify and support potential medal prospects for 2020 and 2024 Olympic Games? So the uh, government has set uh, a healthy target uh, for 2020 Tokyo Olympics and 2004 24 Olympic Games also and target Olympic podium scheme is there that is the top scheme is there and the head is Abhinav Bindra please note Abhinav Bindra is the only Indian individual to win a gold medal in Olympic Games in the history of India individual gold medal and he won it in shooting in 2008 Beijing Olympics he has been made the head for this committee as per the data recently released by the Ministry of Information Technology how many banks till date have been linked to the Aadhaar enabled payment system also called AEPS how many banks in total have um, registered linked to AEPS it is 119 banks till date 119 which state government has signed an MOU with the French based Aero Campus Aquatien to set up a world class aero skills academy in the state so that athletes can be traded athletes can be trained um, in world class uh, with world class facilities so this has been done in telangana an academy world class aero skills academy will be built by the aero campus aquitaine from which date will the general anti avoidance rule be effective and what is this rule this is basically to prevent the uh, money laundering and uh, avoid taxes if there are any attempts to avoid taxes it will counter that it will be applicable from 1st of april 2017 and uh, our minister finance minister cleared the that GAAR can be invoked through a two-stage process involving a node at the level of principal commissioner of income tax and a panel headed by a high court judge and it is basically to prevent companies from routing their transactions through the uh, through other countries so that they can avoid taxes who has been appointed as the new governor of Arunachal Pradesh why there was a need to uh, appoint a new governor of Arunachal Pradesh because the ex-governor was sagged J.P. Raj Khova, he was the governor of Arunachal Pradesh, he was removed and therefore the governor of Nagaland, Mr. P.B. Acharya, P.B. Acharya is made the governor of Arunachal Pradesh, he has been given an additional charge and he is already governor of Nagaland, who has been appointed as the CEO or Chief Executive Officer of India Post Payment Bank, India Post Payment Bank, it is 100% owned by the government and it has opened its branch also. It, uh, it has conducted its exam also the first it is the first payment bank in India which is government owned the first private payment bank in India is of course the Airtel Bharti Airtel payment bank and the person who has been made the head of I uh, PPB is Mr. AP Singh how much amount has the center decided to spend in the development of 1253 kilometer of road in Assam into national highway roads will be converted to national highways in Assam a total stretch of 1253 kilometer of roads in Assam will be converted into national highway so the amount for the same the outlay is 15,000 crore rupees 
and our Union Minister of Road Transport, Highways and Shipping is Nitin Gadkari. In how many districts has the Indian Meteorological Department, also called Mosam Vibhag, our weather department, meteorological department has planned to set up weather stations by the end of the year 2019 in how many districts? So these weather stations will be made in 660 districts. In which country will a personal status and inheritance court for non-Muslims be set up so that there can be equal opportunities to all the sections of the society? Muslims are the majority in this country and this country is UAE, United Arab Emirates. In United Arab Emirates, they have now a personal status and inheritance court for non-Muslims. Whom did Serena Williams beat to win the women's single title in Australian Open? Australian Open, there will be short, short question because it is the first Grand Slam of the year. Very, very important. Australian Open was won by Serena Williams and she beat her elder sister Venus Williams in the final. Serena Williams right now has 23 Grand Slams, uh, which is only one less than Margaret Court who has 24 grand slams so do remember all these things these are very very important and venus williams also made the record for being the oldest player to be in the semi-final of a grand slam in which city of karnataka is deshpande foundation uh, setting india's largest startup incubation center at the end of september 2017 in which city of karnataka is this being done it is hubali hubali is the answer to procure how many fighter aircraft from foreign supplier has the Indian Navy issued a request for information? Indian Navy wants to recruit 57 Navy naval aircrafts and for that it has issued a request of information. The American scientists have developed something known as a human-pig hybrid, which is human also and pig also, so that the organs can be transplanted from this hybrid to the human beings. This is for medical reasons. And what is the name of this organism, which is half human, half pig? It is like a hybrid. So it is called Chimera. Next question. Who won the men's single Australian Open 2017? And this is again a sure short question. And from this question, there are a lot of questions that are possible. Roger Federer won the men's singles Australian Open. And he beat his arc four Rafael Nadal, long time competitor, direct rival, Rafael Nadal is from Spain. He has won 14 Grand Slam and Roger Federer has won 18 Grand Slams, which is highest by any tennis player in history. So that is the greatness of Roger Federer. And Roger Federer is from Switzerland. Rafael Nadal is from Spain. Australian Open. Who won the 2017 Kolkata Marathon, which was held on January the 29th, 2017. So you should know the uh, winners of Mumbai Marathon and Kolkata Marathon both. Kolkata Marathon was won by Abul Hossain. Name the renowned Hollywood actor who acted in three Harry Potter films as Mr. Ollivander and he died very very recently. Again a very short short question. Sir John Hart is the answer. Sir John Hart uh, he played the role of Mr. Ollivander in three of the uh, remain three of the Harry Potter films. And to commemorate the death anniversary of which famous freedom fighter do we celebrate World Leprosy Day in India? World Leprosy Day is celebrated on the death anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi, father of the nation. He was shot by Nathuram Godse on January the 30th, 1948. And Mahatma Gandhi did seminal work in the eradication of leprosy. He helped a lot of leprosy patients. So to contribute his work, we celebrate World Leprosy Day. Who won the men's doubles title at the 2017 Australian Open Tournament? So, men's double was won by a player of Australia called John Pierce and Henry Kottinen. Henry Kottinen is from Finland. When is the National Immunization Day observed? Immunization is active immunization. That is when, uh, when we give a vaccine to somebody that is called immunization. And this day we observe on January the 29th. And who won the Australian Open mixed double title? Mixed double means one male and one female when they form a team that is called mixed double. It was won by Juan Cabal and Abigail Spears. Juan Cabal and Abigail Spears. Juan Cabal is from Colombia and Abigail Spears is from United States of America. Name the uh, team that, that won the women's double title 
So, women's double was won by Bethany Mathex Sands and Lucy Safarova. Please note, these are important questions. You should know all the five winners. Which is the first country in the world to appoint something known as a digital ambassador? This is to represent the country digitally uh, on a global platforms and to form strong linkages. This country is Denmark and Denmark's capital is Copenhagen. The first edition of the Northeast Investor Summit was recently held in which state? And this is basically to attract the investment in the seven northeastern states. The first edition was conducted in Meghalaya. And if they ask where in Meghalaya, it is Shillong. And it was inaugurated by our textile minister, Smriti Irani. How many Grand Slam titles has Serena Williams won? So Serena Williams has won the second highest number of Grand Slams, that is 23. And 24 are won by Margaret Court. So she is just one away from becoming the best. In which place was India's first multi-sports museum called Fanatic Sports Museum inaugurated very, very recently? It is India's first multi-sports museum. It was inaugurated in Kolkata. And uh, during the inauguration, there were a lot of eminent people who were there. Saurabh Ganguly was there, who is the president of Bengal Cricket Association. Sachin Tendulkar was there. Abhinav Bindra, Deepa Malik and Devendra Jhajariya. All of these players were present at the inauguration. Which state government recently decided to amend the Prevention of Cruelty to Animals Bill 1960 Act to legalize Kambal and Bullock Cart Race? So Bullock Cart Race, we all know, Kambal is a buffalo race and both of these are popular sports in Karnataka. So Supreme Court, the Karnataka High Court had banned the games, but the government passed an amendment to make them legal once again. Just like it happened with Jalikattu in Tamil Nadu. Article 213, ordinance was passed and the sport will remain. Which among the following agencies has launched climate change program to assess the status, distribution and conservation of pheasants and finches? These are two birds, pheasants and finches in the central Himalayas. So conservation of birds, two birds, pheasants and finches in the central Himalayas. The answer is Bombay Natural History Society or also called uh, BNHS in short. Bombay Natural History Society launched the climate change program. How many Muslim majority countries uh, have been banned from entering America by United States President Donald Trump. So Donald Trump has banned seven Muslim countries. Uh, he says that uh, this is to pre this is to prevent terrorism. And these seven countries, you should know all of these countries: Iraq, Iran, Libya, Somalia, Sudan, Syria, and Yemen. So Syria, the capital is uh, Damascus. Okay. Yemen, the capital is Sanaa, Sudan is Khartoum, Somalia is Mogadishu, Libya is Tripoli, Iran is Tehran and Iraq is Baghdad. Future generally India insurance company has tied up with which bank to sell its products. Always remember when an insurance company ties up with a bank, it is called bank assurance. That is the insurance company wishes to sell its products through bank network because banks uh, invariably they have a very large user base. So this bank is Bank of Maharashtra. Which private company has backed the contract by the Ministry of Defense to develop, design and construct 14 fast petrol vessels for the Indian Coast Guard? Indian Coast Guard which protects our coastal boundary in the peninsular India, they will get 14 fast petrol vessels made by Reliance Defense and Engineering Limited and this project is worth 916 crore rupees. Kakinada Special Economic Zone Limited has signed an agreement worth how much uh, and this uh, agreement they have signed with various companies to set up world class industrial zone at Kakinada in Andhra Pradesh. So this project is worth 47,000 crore rupees. Which participating contingent was adjudged as the best by the Ministry of Defense in services category in the 2017 Republic Day Parade? So in services category, the best contingent was Madras Engineer Group. And in the, uh, in the paramilitary force category, CISF or Central Industrial Security Force was adjudged as the best. So both of you should know in services category, it was Madras Engineer Group. In the uh, paramilitary force, it is CISF. Who has been crowned as Miss Universe? She is a doctor. She is a trained dental surgeon, dentist. And her name is Iris Mitanier, and she is from France, who has been appointed as the new president of the Table Tennis Federation of India. 
टी टी एफ आई इट इज दुष्यंत चौटाला ऑफ द इंडियन नेशनल लोकदल पार्टी इन एलो दुष्यंत चौटाला फ्रॉम हरियाणा एंड हुज बीन अपॉइंटेड एज द यूनाइटेड नेशन इंडिया गुडविल एम्बेसिडर यूनाइटेड नेशन इंडिया गुडविल एम्बेसिडर फॉर सस्टेनेबल डेवलपमेंट गोल्स इट इज अशोक अमृत राज हु इज अ रिनाउंड ही इज अ प्रोड्यूसर ऑल्सो एंड ही इज अ टेनिस प्लेयर ऑल्सो द एटोमिक क्लॉक ऑफ विच ऑफ द गिवन सेटेलाइट बिलोंगिंग टू एन ए वी आई सी हैव डेवलप्ड अ टेक्निकल स्नैग सो दिस टेक्निकल स्नैग हैज बीन डेवलप्ड एंड द एटोमिक क्लॉक क्लॉक ऑफ विच सेटेलाइट इट इज वन ऑफ द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट सेटेलाइट ऑफ इसरो इट इज कॉल्ड आई आर एन एस एस वन ए एंड द चेयरमैन ऑफ इसरो इज ए एस किरण कुमार हेडक्वार्टर ऑफ इसरो इज इन बेंगलुरु एंड दिस नेविक हैड हाउ मेनी एटोमिक क्लॉक्स वर देयर ट्वेंटी सेवन ट्वेंटी सेवन एटोमिक क्लॉक्स वर देयर एंड हाउ मेनी सेटेलाइट वर देयर इन एन एवीआई सी सेवन सेटेलाइट हुज रिसेंटली बीन अपॉइंटेड एज द चीफ ऑफ दिल्ली पुलिस चीफ ऑफ दिल्ली पुलिस प्रीवियसली इट वॉज मिस्टर अलोक वर्मा एंड फ्रॉम हिम अमूल्य पटनायक हैज टेकन ओवर सो अमूल्य पटनायक इज द न्यू चीफ ऑफ दिल्ली पुलिस विच इंडियन सेटेलाइट विच इज डेप्लॉयड और एस्टेब्लिश बाय द इसरो हैज द कैपेबिलिटी टू डिटेक्ट फार्म फायर्स इफ देर आर एनी फायर ऑन योर फार्म हाउस इट कैन बी डिटेक्टेड बाय दिस सेटेलाइट द नेम ऑफ दिस सेटेलाइट इज इन सेट थ्री डी आर इन सेट थ्री डी आर who has been appointed the head of the bcci administrative committee by the supreme court so this is as per the recommendation of the lodha committee the bcci uh, was dismissed anurag thakur and everyone was dismissed and they have come up with their four names like ramchandra guha like vikram limaye like vinod rai so vinod rai very very honest bureaucrat ex bureaucrat ex controller and auditor general of india he has been made the head of bcci by supreme court Who won the Syed Modi International Grand Prix in women's singles title? Syed Modi International Grand Prix was won by Olympic silver medalist P.V. Sindhu. And please also note that Malaysian Masters Grand Prix was won by Sena Nehwal. Name the famous journalist who died very recently, and he was a very famous journalist, and he was one of the witnesses to the assassination of Bapu Mahatma Gandhi. So, what is his name? His name is Dev Dutt. Emmanuel Riva she also passed away recently she was a very renowned personality in which field so she was a very very famous french actress she was from france she was an actress so the answer is acting to commemorate the death anniversary of which great freedom fighter we celebrate martyrs day martyrs day also called shaheed divas we celebrate on the death anniversary of mahatma gandhi ji and mahatma gandhi ji's death anniversary is also celebrated as world leprosy day The success story of which Indian digital wallet company is now made a Harvard case study, Harvard Business School case study. It is of course Paytm. Now three organizations have come together to um, they have signed an MOU to enhance the capability of the institute in assisting its Drip project. So Drip project is a very important project. It is called Dam Rehabilitation. and improvement project it is for dams so along with iis iis indian institute of science bengaluru with which institute has the central water commission signed a mou two institutes have signed mou with cwc one is iis bengaluru other is iit madras who has been appointed as the new chancellor of the nalanda university his appointment was ratified by the uh, president of india he was appointed by the president of india and his name is vijay pandurung bhatkar who among the following has been inducted into the 2017 ophthalmology hall of fame by the american society of cataract and refractive surgery he is a very very renowned doctor and he is founder and chairman of lv prasad i institute his name is dr gullu gulla palli rao who has been appointed as the new chairman of the commission of the african union african union in short au who is the new chairman of the commission of the african union it is mr musa faki Musa Faki he is prime minister of Chad According to the Economic Survey of India what is the GDP growth of India that for financial year 2018 that is from 1st April 2017 to 31st March 2018 India's GDP is expected to grow by 6.75 to 7.5% I have made a complete coverage video for economic survey do check that out with which company online travel company has the Madhya Pradesh government 
tourism department tied up to promote home stay stay scheme so which online travel company has signed a colla a collaborated with madhya pradesh tourism department it is make my trip dot com name our cabinet minister union minister who launched the digital radio round table conference digital radio round table conference was launched by our union minister for information and broadcasting venkaiya naidu which operation has been launched by the income tax department to track the deposits post demonetization that was on 8th of november which operation has been launched it is called operation clean money clean money who has won uh, the 2017 sayed modi tournament along with pv sindhu but this time in men's category so it is samir verma name the national leprosy awareness campaign that was organized by the union government on anti leprosy day what is the name of that program this program was called sparsh campaign sparsh means touching someone in which of the following cities did the 2017 north east film festival neff has started north east film festival it has started in uh, in uh, pune and it has started in pune so that the the you know the producers and the interesting interested parties from north east can showcase their talent so pune is the answer in maharashtra in which city uh, india pharma and india medical device 2017 this conference will take place from 11th to 13th of february so it will take place in the science city space city it city bengaluru and the most dynamic city as per the recent index with which country has the government of india recently signed white shipping agreement white shipping agreement is for mutual cooperation in shipping to have maritime cooperation etc this we have signed with france the french president is françois holland and he is a socialist he is from socialist party sir john hurt he passed away he was a actor of which country sir john hurt again he acted in harry potter series i have already told you and he was from england cepi has officially cipi was officially launched at 2017 world economic forum to create new vaccines for emerging infectious disease so what is the full form of CP, cepi cepi means coalition for epidemic preparedness coalition for epidemic preparedness innovation which means something that protects us from epidemic diseases in which city has india's first post office passport seva kendra also called popsk in short has been inaugurated in which city has india's first post office passport seva kendra inaugurated it has been inaugurated in mysuru which city has topped the 2017 jll city momentum index jll city momentum index has been uh, has given the verdict that the most dynamic city in india in the world is bengaluru how much amount has been sanctioned by the world bank world bank president is jim yong kim headquarters is in washington dc world bank has authorized 1376 crore rupees for power upgradation projects in tripura tripura is a northeastern state its capital is agartala and cm chief minister is manik sarkar in which city was the international symposium or conference on medicinal and aromatic plants of india recently held and it was organized by the ministry of ayush and it is Ayur ayurveda yoga yunani siddhya homeopathy shripad yeso nayak is the minister of state with independent charge for ayush it was organized in new delhi in which city was the first ever first ever asia pacific broadcasting union international dance held recently it was organized on it uh, 19 january in hyderabad which team won the 2017 vodafone premier badminton league premier badminton league tournament was won by chennai smashers they beat uh, they beat mumbai rockets in the final the final took place at siri fort complex in which state is aditya aditya is the name of solar power boat the boat will run from solar power launched it was launched by the chief minister pinarayi vijayan who is a communist party of india marxist leader left party leader from kerala he is a cm of kerala in which state is chhabra thermal power plant located chhabra thermal power plant is located in motipura village in baran district of rajasthan and why it was in news it was in news because uh, ntpc national thermal power corporation has bought 
छाबड़ा थर्मल पावर प्लांट वेयर इज द हेड ऑफिस ऑफ द थिंक टैंक अटलांटिक काउंसिल सिचुएटेड अटलांटिक काउंसिल इज द हेडक्वार्टर इज इन वॉशिंगटन डीसी एंड इट वॉज इन न्यूज रिसेंटली बिकॉज ऑफ सम इंटरनेशनल अफेयर्स वट इन इंटरेस्ट रेट विल बी ऑफर्ड बाय द एयरटेल पेमेंट बैंक ऑन सेविंग्स अकाउंट सो फाइनली यू विल गेट सेवन पॉइंट टू फाइव परसेंट ऑन योर पेमेंट बैंक वेरी वेरी हाई इंटरेस्ट जनरली यू गेट अराउंड फोर परसेंट इंटरेस्ट ऑन योर सेविंग्स अकाउंट बट यू विल गेट सेवन पॉइंट टू फाइव परसेंट ऑल दो देर इज अ लिमिट ऑफ वन लैख रुपीज ऑन डिपोजिट नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन हु वॉज स्वन इन एज द न्यू प्रेजिडेंट ऑफ निकार गुआ कैन यू टेल मी द कैपिटल ऑफ निकार गुआ इफ यू कैन नॉट ईजी राइट डाउन इन कॉमेंट्स इफ यू नो द कैपिटल ऑफ निकार गुआ माई फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन फॉर यू टूडे सो प्रेजिडेंट ऑफ निकार गुआ इज डेनियल ऑल्टेगा हु हैज बिकम द थर्ड टाइम प्रेजिडेंट इन विच कंट्री वॉज द टू थाउजेंड सेवनटीन इंटरनेशनल कॉन्फ्रेंस ऑन डिसेबिलिटी कम्युनिकेशन वॉज हेल्ड रिसेंटली सो दिस वॉज हेल्ड इन इंडिया इट सेल्फ इन मुंबई महाराष्ट्र विच कंट्री विल ऑर्गेनाइज द इवेंट फेस्टिवल ऑफ इंडिया एंड इन दिस इंडियन डांस म्यूजिक एक्सेट्रा विल बी शोकेस्ट दिस कंट्री इज घाना इन एफ्रीका द कैपिटल ऑफ घाना इज आकरा Which of the following Kalwari class scorpion stealth submarine? Submarine means which is under water, and stealth means something that hits secretly. So it has been launched recently for sea trials. So it it is INS Kandheri. Which organization recently released the Global Risk Report 2017? Global Risk Report was launched by the World Economic Forum. It was the twelfth such report. Shreyas Mehta is associated with which sport? Shreyas Mehta he won the under 13 squash player of India. He won recently the Scottish Junior Open Championship, uh, and the championship was conducted in Scotland. So the answer is squash. Peter Sarstedt. Peter Sarstedt he passed away recently. He was a well-known singer and a songwriter from which country? He was from England. Name the Indian teenager. who has won the young travel photographer of the year award young teenager and uh, he won it his name is darpan basak with which sport is velavan santhal kumar associated again a very important player he is again also from squash he recently won the under 19 british junior open squash 2017 title zigmot bomen one of the most renowned sociologist of all time he has recently passed away and he belong to which country so he is from poland the capital of poland is warsaw it's a european country name the insurance company which has tied up with sidbi bank for giving capital support to enterprises or businesses and this company is the life insurance corporation of india lic please also note that government has reduced their stake in all the major five go uh, government insurance companies by 25% in uh, where was the all india conference of wakf board recently took place All India Conference of Work Board was uh, recently organized in New Delhi. Which film won the award Golden Globe Award for the best film category? So, which film won the best film award at the Golden Globe? It is Moonlight. And La La Land won seven awards. It was nominated in seven categories, and in all the seven categories, it won. So, it created history. But the best motion film was Moonlight. Akbar Hashemi Rafsanjani passed away recently. He was the former president of which country? He was one of the former president of Iran. He was 82 years old. Which tennis player won the 2017 Air Cell Chennai Open Men's Doubles Tournament? It was won by Rohan Bopanna and Jeevan Nadunchezia. Rohan Bopanna and Jeevan Nadunchezia. And the 2017 National Conference called Jal Manthan Third will be held in which city? Jal Manthan Third. So it will. It was recently held in New Delhi. who has been appointed as the brand ambassador for asian paints ultima protec asian paints has avoid, appointed which person as their brand ambassador so it is mr ranbir kapoor for what amount has orbindo pharma orbindo pharma is a company located in hyderabad its headquarter is in hyderabad so orbindo pharma has acquired which portugal's pharma company the answer is given generous but for what amount they are asking so it is 135 million euro who has been appointed as the managing director and ceo of sbi pension funds private limited it is mr kumar sharadindu he is the 
CEO of SBI Pensions Fund Limited and who is named as the new brand ambassador of the Chinese mobile phone company called Jioni. Jioni have appointed Virat Kohli who is now the captain in all the three format T20 one day and test matches of India. With which firm has the Rajasthan government collaborated to develop Jaipur as the next startup destination after Bengaluru. So Rajasthan government has collaborated with Cisco and Cisco will develop Jaipur as the next startup destination. Which bank has recently waived off or uh, cancelled the merchant discount rate for one year on the debit card transaction for small merchants with annual turnover of rupees 20 lakh. Up to rupees 20 lakh if you have income your merchant discount rate on debit was waived off by this particular bank. The name of this bank is State Bank of India. In which district of Andhra Pradesh is the new campus for the National Disaster Response Force being built? NDRF, National Disaster Response Force, their campus is being built in Krishna district. And who won, won a gold medal in the Thai Boxing Championship? The, he is only 8 years old. Only 8 years old and he is a class 2 student from Jammu and Kashmir. His name is Abu Amaz. Scientists have predicted the formation of a new plate boundary on the floor of the Indian Ocean due to the largest earthquake of 2012 that hit Andaman and Sumatra region and Sumatra region is adjacent to Indonesia and may lead to future quakes. All this, is, all this happens in the Bay of Bengal. So what is the name of that earthquake? It is called the slip strike quake. Who is appointed as the new High Commissioner of India? High Commissioner is same as Ambassador. So Ambassador of India to Republic of Seychelles. So this is a direct question. Dr. Asaf Saeed is the answer. For what amount has the BPO company WNS services recently acquired American company Denali. What is the what is the cost? So they have paid US 40 million for the same. In which state have the European IT company Atos and Nascom Foundation collaborated together Nascom and IT company Atos they will make National Digital Literacy Mission Center. So this agreement they have signed with Gujarat. Who has been appointed as the Chief Executive Officer of Ola Fleet Technology? Ola Fleet Technology, it is Shalab Sate. Name the American jazz pop singer well known for his album The Lady is a Trump who passed away recently. So his name was Buddy Greco. Buddy Greco. Who is the author of the new cyber vocabulary books called Partshala? Cyber Partshala. It was launched by Tarun Vijay and its inauguration was done by HRD Minister Prakash Javadekar. Name the former director of MRF Tires who recently died. He was also a member of the uh, Rubber Board of India. His name is K.M. Philip. Which state recently presented a power budget with special focus on reforms in the respective sector, in power sector. So this special power budget was, or, uh, was presented in Jammu and Kashmir which has a People's Democratic Party, P PDP, Chief Minister in Mahbuba Mufti. Which bank has helped the temples in Tamil Nadu to go digital? Which bank is helping the temples in digit, uh, Tamil Nadu so that they can accept cash donations? This bank is the HDFC Bank and the Chairman and Managing Director of HDFC Bank is Aditya Puri. Which Indian political leader has been appointed as the Senior Fellow of the US-based think tank Atlantic Council? So Atlantic Council was in news because they have uh, appointed Manish Tiwari as their senior fellow. Name the Union Minister of Minority Affairs. He was in news because of the Hajj pilgrimage and many other reasons. His name is Mukhtar Abbas Nakvi. He has the Ministry of Minority Affairs. According to 2017 World Employment and Social Outlook Report of International Labour Organization, the global unemployment is expected to increase by what number for the year 2017? So the employment will be 3.4 million. It will increase by 3.4 million. 34 lakh people will become jobless. And World Bank has said that 69% people have a threat from losing jobs because of uh, automation, because of artificial intelligence. Name the Indian boxer who has become the first female boxer to enter into professional boxing. So the first male boxer who has become professional is Vijender Singh and the first female is Sarita Devi. Can you tell me Sarita Devi is from which state? Which country has been recently appointed to chair or head the United Nations Group of 77 that looks after the interest of the 134 developing countries? 
This time this honor has been given to Ecuador. With which country has India signed a memorandum of understanding for the construction of 3000 rainwater harvesting system? 3000. So we have done it with Sri Lanka. With which airline, Indian airline, uh, which Indian airline firm has signed a pact with American aircraft manufacturer Boeing for the purchase of 205 aircraft? 205 aircraft will be uh, purchased from Airbus by SpiceJet. Who is appointed as the president of Maharashtra Cricket Association? It is Mr. Ashish Sheldar. Ashish Shelar. The government on January 11 decided to sell what percentage of its stake in Pawan Hans, uh, which is a helicopter service operator. There were a lot of crashes in Pawan Hans. Uh, so the government has decided to not renew the contract of Pawan Hans. So the question is how much loss it has suffered? It has suffered. It will suffer 51% loss. Who won the best director award at the 62nd Film Fair Award? He is the director of a movie Dangal. His name is Nitesh Tiwari and the best actor was Amir Khan again Dangal. Best film was again Dangal. Who won the 62nd Film Fair Critics Award? Critics Award is like a consolation award for best film and won by which film? So it is Nirja. Nirja based on the movie of Nirja Bhanoth. So that you have to remember. The character of Nir Nirja Bhanoth was played by Sonam Kapoor. Recently, by what percent has Securities and Exchange Board of India, SEBI, which is a market regulator, market watchdog, lowered the broker fee to reduce the overall cost of transaction? So they have reduced the broker fee to 25%. Name the telecom company which has recently launched something known as Customer Acquisition and Customer Communication Management Project to provide Aadhaar Cast based E KYC or E Know Your Customer Service to Consumer. This company is Bharat Sanchar Nigal Limited or BSNL. In which state was the two day annual Camel Festival held? Camel Festival, so you can understand we are talking about Rajasthan, and in Rajasthan it was launched in Bikaner. Which city in Kerala has been declared as the first elderly friend friendly city of the state? If you are an elder, you can very easily navigate through this state. And it has been ranked as the best place, elderly friendly place. And the name of this place is Cozy Code. On which day the American president Barack Obama declared to celebrate January 16 each, week, each uh, year with effect from the year 2017. So Obama wants to celebrate uh, which day. So uh, American president Obama has declared to celebrate January 16 as the religious freedom day name the famous physiologist and he was also a nobel Peace, nobel prize winner he um, he discovered something known as knockout mice these were his uh, experiments on mice what is his name his name is oliver smithis which business enhancement program has been launched by yes bank to deepen its collaboration with financial technology startups the name is yes fintech which country has won the Nations Cup 2017? Nations Cup, very important cup. I am talking about, uh, I am talking about boxing. So it was won by Kazakhstan. Kazakhstan is the answer. Which bank has launched the facility of customizable savings account to enable the customer selective customer select account features as per convenience? So which account, which account, even cust uh, savings account, you can easily access for your changing of the uh, various procedures and uh, another question which might they, which they might ask is that uh, the savings account and current account difference but they will not ask that in uh, in this they will ask it in the mcq format so the bank is yes bank which telecom company has recently launched their mobile tv which is called ditto tv so ditto tv was launched by again bsnl bharat sanchar nigam limited who has uh, been signed by Mercedes because the champion of last season Nico Rosberg has retired in place of him Mr. Valtteri Boltas has come Political leader Tarun Prasad Chatterjee he recently passed away he was a former minister of which state he was from Congress party he was a senior Congress politician the answer is Chhattisgarh in which country was the world's first baby using the new three person intra uh, IVF technology 
called pron nuclear transfers born in which country was the world's first baby born uh, to be uh, to be uh, you know taking birth from the ivf technology and this is mexico now there is a fish and the fisheries department has said to give legal protection to this fish otherwise it will become extinct the name is hisla fish who has been appointed as the chief executive officer and managing director of bharti axa general insurance bharti axa general insurance mr sanjeev shrinivasan has taken over as the ceo name the indian scientist who died on january 16 2017 and he was a very well known person he was also called the black hole man of india because he did extensive research on the black holes which are there on our planets it is mr uh, mr c v vishweswara which is that chinese robot journalist this robot is actually a journalist and it recently wrote a blog also it uh, made its debut and by it uses uh, by writing an article in a second so it, it kind of blogged the name is zionen how many more countries have applied to join the aiib bank a asian infrastructure investment bank which is a chinese dominated bank headquarter is in beijing so total number of countries which have applied for its membership is 30 57 are already present as its member which indian mass communication institute has recently launched recently launched a full time diploma course in urdu language it is launched by indian institute of mass communication with which of the following institution has the government of india signed a mou to set up 1000 jan aushadhi kendra 1000 jan aushadhi kendra will be uh, will be set up by national yuva cooperative society name the pakistani cricketer who became the first uh, pakistani cricketer the fastest to score 1000 runs his name is babar azam who has been named as india's ambassador to grenada and he will live uh, in port of spain which is in west indies it is mr bishwadeep de fl at school that is financial literacy fl financial literacy at school it is an initiative by the government and it has been launched by which bank which bank has launched it it is the keral gramin bank which indian football player has recently signed a deal to join the spanish football club esportiu jupiter esportiu jupiter his name is jayesh ram rai malani which indian film has won the best feature film award at the international borrego springs film festival which was held in california america on 16 jan the name of the film is sanj and they will ask the director also the director of sanj is ajay saklani which indian has been appointed as the member of the fifa's finance committee on january 20th 2017 it is ex union minister praful patel who was once uh, civil aviation minister also so these were the best questions uh, if you are watching this video in english please share the video as much as you can thank you